Hello everyone, this is Cypherdeck, and today we're back in Ox Fatalis. We're going to continue where we left off, and I, I guess we're going to go this direction first, and then we'll go back. Hello? So I had great comments left on the last video, and I wanted to go ahead and post a comment here where um, I was given some information. One of them is... The diamond or the shape that's at the bottom center lights up really bright like it is now whenever you have it at maximum damage. So meaning that if I go up to this goblin and I hit him with this, it's going to hit him very hard. If I wait, um, then it's going to knock him very hard. Okay, who are you running to, sir? He can run pretty fast. I don't know if it's something that I'm doing wrong. What was it? Oh. Here is human. Okay. Okay, I didn't. Don't die. You I I did that early. Where are you running to, guy? Oh, you better not be running to. Uh, there he goes. Did I just cut off his arm? That's a thing. Wait a minute, was that in the red or something, or was it over that blood? Okay, I stabbed him twice in the chest. <laughs> so, there's that. We're going to have to organize our inventory today, too. I feel that we're... I... Yep, I got four. We're going to have to organize our inventory today. I feel that's going to be one of the things that will help us later on. Like put things in order. Like um, these are plants. Uh, we'll go ahead and put these all together. Seeing this is going to be a persistent item. Um, or at least I believe so. It's part of a quest I'm guessing. We're going to put that there. I'm not going to use the club anymore or that dagger, so I'll go ahead and throw that away. We're going to put gemstones. Oh, actually, we're going to put... Uh, let's see here. We're going to put liquids next to liquids. There we are. I'm going to go ahead and memorize this spell, get it out of our inventory. Um... One more. We'll put foods next to foods. We'll put those mushrooms up there. It's kind of part of this magical section here. Um, this is the first note that we got. I think we're not going to collect notes. We might collect uh, other things, but not those. And we're going to go ahead and bring this up here. Good to go. So let's go this way first. Um, can I click on those bars? No. We have a um, guy here. All right. Charge up. Wow, he was on his feet fast. Okay, he hasn't hit me yet. Okay, he hit me there, but it wasn't for much. Okay, we'll go ahead and take... Didn't mean to do that, but uh, okay. <laughs> and that will add to our pile over here. I feel this is the best way to do our inventory. Just something that we can... Oh, flower. I forgot about this. Okay. We'll mess with that in a, in a minute. We'll grab the fish. What is that? What is that? Oh. It's a spike holding this up. Not seeing anything behind there. Okay. <laughs> uh, 
There's something that doesn't look like everything else in the room. I wonder what it is. Is this a thing? It is. Oh, a secret door. Okay, we're gonna grab that. Again, another potion. Ooh, um, we're gonna have to move this. Okay, we'll, okay. Let's move this here. Let's move this out here. We're gonna move this to here. Move that to there. Oh, uh, there's the, oh, wait a minute, what? Wait a minute. Let's see, move this over to here. This to there. No, no, no. Sorry, I gotta have my inventory. Gotta have it. There it is. Inventory is set. Okay. Um, got a, the key to the goblin outpost. Definitely take that. This authorization, owner free to go through Goblin Kingdom, delivered by, and then uh, we are probably gonna have to get that sorted. I'll leave that on the side. Let's see here. My dear Goblin friends, as our agreement seems set to continue, I would like to confirm my order for two more humans to sacrifice to our beloved Akaba. You will receive a thousand gold per head. Upon delivery, I will bring you the priceless sum in person, Lord Isabus. I guess that's how you would say that. Great, great note. We'll leave it there. Um, yes. Okay, we now have another gem, a lot of money, and a key. Um, and I think that's perfect where it is at the moment. I think we're good here. We have stairs that are leading up, but I was given some information about something that we missed last time. So, before we go up there, we'll go ahead and go check out what that was. All right, so here we are with Coltar. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and check out the thing that they mentioned with the elevator. Now, as far as the wall, I believe we need a, I'm gonna say pickaxe, but I may be wrong about that. Um, but I think we need something to strike against the wall to be able to take it down and did I not pick those up last time? Wonder if the others are respawned up there. We'll have to check. Oh, okay. This is a fantastic time to do this. So, I think you guys are going to be amazed. Though, I only want I only want to do one. So, what we're going to do is we're going to click on our water bottle. And we're going to click on the flower. And it's going to make bread dough. Put that down. This, if I remember correctly, this is uh, going to be amazing. Yeah, look at it. It's growing. It's growing. <laughs> yes. That is. Oh, I didn't mean to eat it. Oh, I wasted. That's a good nutritional uh, food there. Dang it. I didn't mean to do that, but uh, yeah, the bread grows as it's being cooked, which is Gotta so amazing. Just like that. All right. Only thing I can suggest is maybe try a key. It's too sturdy for me to break. Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna wait. I think I need a pickaxe for it. Uh, it's been a long time, but I'm pretty sure that's correct. But we can still mess with the elevator. That was one thing that they advised is that I didn't mess with the elevator enough so here we have this stone we put on here it's not doing anything nothing is changing 
What they said though is that I didn't mess with this pressure plate. So I'm going to go ahead and remove these. Okay, and that didn't do anything. See, originally I thought this pressure plate and that pressure plate were for the elevator. But I should be able to bring the elevator down. So that is not the issue. Let's go ahead and put this stone on here. Oh! Snap! A door. Another thing that I wasn't paying attention to, or I, I was and I didn't understand it correctly, is that down here on the left hand side you see the little sneaky icon? It's not because I'm pressing sneak, it's because I'm in a dark area. So if I was to uh, press C and I press shift, I would be considered stealthy or sneaky, sneaky stealth, both. Okay, let's go ahead and take that and that. A new oh. <gasps> what? Where'd you come from? Wait a minute. Maybe I was looking at this wrong last time, but was this open before? I don't remember this being here. Maybe I'm maybe I'm thinking too much into it. Um look back at the video whenever I pass by here, I guess, whenever I'm coming over this way, check and see if that's there whenever I whenever I do that. I I sure will once I get done recording. But, uh, yeah, that's something that's very odd, okay? This, this is why I was getting excited. Tools. These are for pick locks. Now, I don't believe I have the skill, okay? Move the stack of bread, okay. I'm gonna press shift and click it. <sighs> Rope. Rope is the worst takes up so many spots takes up four spots for a rope all right do we got we got a new potion to deal with oh I didn't move them all Um, mushrooms, maybe. And then, uh, ooh, well, this could come over here under that, and then we can move this there. And I got an apple, I know, it's, it's there, but I think we got everything there. We got a new key too. I guess this is the new key. Little metal key. Alright. So once I've opened a door with a key. Do I need that key again? Meaning. Can I clear that my bag of that space? Hmm. I think one of these keys must go to this, but before we do that... It's too complicated for Oh, me. sounds like it's going to open and then <laughs> it doesn't. Alright, let's try this one. This is our newest one. So, I'm going to say that I don't need this key anymore. What, right? Is there Would there be another door for this key? I can't, I can't get myself to throw away a key, though. I now have more apples. You know what? I'm not going to worry about apples. Oh, do I? Yes. Okay, I'll keep the apples. <laughs> twisted, my, twisted my wrist on that one. All right, grab the money. <gasps> there it is. There it is. Oh, my goodness. All right. 
Uh, it's Coltar. This right here, take a bottle of water, click it on here, we make dough. Click this on the dough, we make pie. I think pie is the best food as far as the dough based products. <gasps> Oh my goodness. No, it's an apple pie. Can we have a mushroom pie? Is there such thing as a mushroom pie? Maybe. Oh, what if I did. What if I did the mushrooms with that? Okay, it's still cooked fish. It doesn't make anything new. What about with the ribs? Doesn't make a soup. What if I did. This on the mushroom. Okay. No. I'll have to work on it. Either way. Um, some, un uh, some fresh fish. You know, I don't need any more food. But I will take more flour. Okay. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay. Never mind. I thought I saw something. Maybe I missed it. All right, <laughs> let's go back up and finish this this area that we're currently in. So when we did this last time, we went this way. So we know the exit to go up is this way. We're going to go this way now. It's a goblin. I like human here. Hey! Human! Mwah! Yep, I went for his head. <laughs> I don't know why he still leans up whenever he's dying. Um, do I have cheese? don't but we'll go ahead and take the cheese it might be for making a, uh, a cheese sandwich or something like that let's check nope can I click it on anything else nope all right, anyway. <laughs> oh. Okay, so we've used this key. Let's try this key. Nice. No. <laughs> Very nice. Very. Oh, hello. Oh my goodness. Now, if I remember correctly, and I, I'm i going to have to look it up, each one of these uh, symbols equals a, a word. Like, I believe this is um, create, and this is fire. So, if we use these, create fire... Well, I already see it here. It's already tabbed over to three, but create fire um, ball or missile, I think is what this is actually meaning. So create fire missile. That's why this is a fireball. So anyway, we now have a fire a fireball that we can create. A lot of clubs here. Uh, did I check this yet? Oh my gosh, so much food. We need the apples though. We're going to be making that apple pie. We got a water basin over here. It's amazing. We can, oh, we could cook. This is, this is where we're going to do it. This is where we're going to be cooking pies. All right. Um, you look out of place. <laughs> that was pretty easy. 
Um, I'm gonna pick this up only to sell. I think I'm gonna leave the keys here. Um, I'm not gonna let this door. Go. Wait a minute. You know what? I'm gonna leave the keys right outside the door. If we need these keys again for anything, I don't think we do. And I will be told probably in the comments <laughs> if we do. But I'm going to leave those right here for now. I don't feel that we're going to need them again. Alright, so water basin. What we do now is I'm going to... Uh, actually, I'm not going to do that. Right, move this over here. Can I shift click all of those? No, I can only do one at a time. Okay, now we have six bottles of water. We have six things here. What we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and turn all those to dough. Then we're going to go ahead and turn all of these to pies. Two, one. All right. Now I wonder, can I make a meat pie? I cannot. Can I make a cheese pie? No. That's the only thing I could think of. So, apples it is. So, we're going to go ahead and do this. Now, we could go ahead and get more water here. But I want to leave these vials empty. Because we are going to use them. Whenever we get to the point where we can make potions. To uh, put our ingredients in. So, we're going to leave these empty we now have one pie that is not an apple pie we'll leave it as is until we get more apples but now we're going to go ahead and start putting apple pies on here we'll go ahead and you know what no i'm not going to waste it i don't think you can overcook your apple pie just have to make sure it's on the burner. And this is how I cook in Oxfay Tavis. <laughs> okay, put it down. Alright, for some reason he's... Oh. Okay, let's go ahead and grab that. I don't know why it took the whole stack. That is my full... Oh, no! Where'd it go? Where'd my pie go? It's gone forever. Alright, let's go ahead and put that on there. One there. And one there. If we ever need food again, I, I don't know what I'm going to do about it. <laughs> Alright. This is, of course, to uh, repair your be stuff. I should repair my weapons with that. But we don't have the skill. Um, while we do have high object knowledge, we do not have uh, high strength. So our strength is what merits our repair skill plus object knowledge. So, uh, oh, I didn't even grab that. That's just a, uh, that's a damaged. And just to show you how this works, this right here is 29. This is how, what would happen if I would put my my main weapon on here. I cannot improve them any further. Now it reduces it from a durability of 50 or 2950 to 2929. So it can't get better. It can't go up in skill. It can only stay at what it is currently. 
and say I hit something with that sword, it would, um, okay, let's go ahead and re, it would, um, probably go down to say 26 and if I tried to repair it again it would stay at 26 because of the fact I just don't have the skill available let's move this back over to here I'm gonna keep these keys for now I it just feels wrong I'm just gonna put them over here because it says I've used these keys if we get to a point where inventory is really getting tight we'll deal with it at that point in time Okay, so we have this area over here. I guess this would be where, um, I guess this would be where you would go to use the main key that we got. Oh. Wow. Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and put these two keys here. Put this at the top and this here. Oh my goodness. <laughs> We're going to run out of space soon. All right. This is the last key. Did I use a small key on that door? Did I drop my main, the, the, the primary key, I guess? Oh, that's right. I didn't drop them. I kept them. That's, that's why you keep keys, my friends. That is why you keep the keys. There we go. So we've used the two small keys and now the big key. And I've heard you but I oh uh, hello space them I think that means like area um why do I always have problems with this one and it was I can't cast this spell yet. Wait, wasn't that the spell? Alright, I guess I'll have to check. Wait a minute. Oh, you know what? I didn't. It's a level 11 spell. It's going to use a lot of mana to be able to cast it. I'm going to go ahead and pre-cast it though. <laughs> I didn't get it wrong that time. Okay, it is now on my bar. It's number two. I already have it primed. Holy cow. Oh, how do you cancel a spell again? Oh! <laughs> well, now all my mana is gone. It lasts until my mana is completely out. Don't think we're gonna be grabbing those any of them uh, soon. Okay, can I? I probably need a spell to get up here. Um, if I remember correctly, there is a spell. So if I was to get over there, I should be able to walk over there. I just can't remember what it's called. It's like a, a levitate spell, I think. Oh, there used to be something that you used for this. I can't cast this spell yet. I think that's it, but it's been a long time. Hello? 
I mean you no harm. Uh, me grew. Me here because left troll camp. Not want to work for goblins. Me not like goblins. Goblins are little. Can't trust goblins. Goblins think trolls stupid. So me live here. I'm all with fishes. Fish not give orders. And me eat them. Hmm. So if I understand correctly, the trolls work for the goblins. Hard king of trolls. Follow goblins orders. Gru hate goblins. Gru prefer stay here. Free. No orders. No working. Gru make music. Gru make statue. Gru art it. Today, <laughs> Gru's birthday. Happy birthday, Gru. But Gru alone. Him not have friends. Ah. Uh. Him not have presents. Burwaka. Only friend of Gru. Up there. Him work for goblins. Gru sad. Well, maybe we could be friends. Really? You want to be Gru's friend? Oh, me have no friend. <laughs> well, friend. What you got for Gru's birthday then? A present. <laughs> Let me see what I can do. Uh... He likes fish. He likes music, and he likes to make art. Um, would you like a pie? Oh, not! Don't do that. Um, How does that please you? Maybe a birthday cake. <laughs> all right let's go ahead and grab all this real quick I think it's gonna be harder than it just seems on the surface so we're gonna definitely go ahead and um, wait I'm not seeing anything here Yep. It's probably like stop, stop, stop scaring the fish, man. I'm, I'm having, I'm fishing over here, singing some music and making some art. <laughs> All right. Well, let's go ahead and continue on. We know that we need to get him a gift now. Does it really update the? I meant a troll today. Yes. Okay. So it does update that. You just have to flip through the pages, I guess. Um, yeah. Now that you have fin uh, your first rune, open your... Okay. Alright, so we are on... Page 3. Okay. Okay, this must be his bed area. fresh fish can, I, I wonder can you put fish on here that is negatory okay I mean he looks like he's doing good that looked like it was perfect look look up a Why, with this one rune, am I having so much problems? It's usually whenever I do it really close to each other, it works better. <laughs> I'm gonna have to practice that, I guess. I don't know what it is that I'm doing wrong. Uh, in the spell book, it says... Why? Why does that work whenever I'm not actually... Ugh.
All right. Oh, we didn't. We never did try our new spell. It was. always works now. There we go. It is now in our book. I don't know why it pops that up every time. Alright, so we need to head back this way. This leads to the... to going up. And then we'll go ahead and see what's going on up there. Really enjoying the game again. It's um, one of those cool little gotta figure out what everything is inventory management is huge all right and here we are nice place for a loot nice out and open and <laughs> okay earthquakes All right, let's, before we check the water, because you know I'm gonna check the water, let's go ahead and just go to the left here and check out these areas first. Okay, there's something there. Chicken. Chicken. Every bloody day I eat chicken. Chicken. Every bloody day I eat chicken, is <laughs> what he said. <laughs> Let's go ahead and look around this. Oh, hello. A spell casting ring. Casting plus 10%. Don't want to take that. A lot of tiny rats. Hey, I'm not seeing anything there. Lily pad. Take that, of course. We got some bodies here. That's not good. Um, take the cheese. Um, well, we won't take that though. Okay, let's go ahead and look in here. By the way, I like making the map look nice, so I go around these little circle things. Oh, hello. Another uh, Emakar rock. Hey, there's a guy here with some lily pads there. A regeneration ring. Definitely can use that. I'll take the water. But we won't take the bones. Nice. Okay, it looks like we're good. <laughs> Sorry. I got I, I can't have it all messy. I need a nice clean map. Well, this looks like they took on a uh, great siege and well they didn't do very well okay nothing behind the doors at last the reinforcements go and see Ortion immediately the reinforcements please go and see if Ortion is still alive he should be upstairs. In his quarters. Alright, upstairs. We're gonna check down here first. I don't think he is going to be gone 
right away. Take some coin. Oh, another blacksmithy. Oh, yes. It is on. Now, the problem here is we're going to now have to start drinking things, though. I'm going to... Okay. Whoa. I, I forgot about that. <laughs> uh... We are drunk now. Uh, and, um, wow. This is drunkness. We're about blackout drunk. Grab that. Okay, it looks like it's going away. So, all we need now is a, I think it's called a distillery. I don't think we can use just a, uh, like the water thing that we had before. I don't think we can use just that. Okay, I don't know what would have been here. Maybe a, a guard station uh, or a uh, register. I'll never be able to move all this myself. Something that would probably take care of whatever comes through that tunnel. Uh, a guard station, maybe. Some vegetables there. Carrot cake? I don't know. Carrot cake. What? What if we? What if we? And then we. Still bread though. I don't know how to cake, if there is a cake. Maybe that's what he wants for his birthday, is a cake. Okay. Nothing on those. There's blood here, but there's no body. Two chests. Now, I'm going to tell you right now, I don't have the skill to open those. Because I... <laughs> I'm very lacking in the skill of pick locks. I don't want to waste my uh, pick pick lock tools. A civilian. Oh, hello. Oh, this is Ortius. I am Ortius, captain of the King's or armies and commander of this outpost. Are you a mercenary? Can we count on your help? Mercenary. Perhaps. For now, I have just put some distance between myself and a couple of goblins. What happened to you? We were attacked by a small group of Ilsids. They wounded me and took three of my men. The Ilsids? Yeah. What are those? Two hours ago, three of them infiltrated the outpost. They attacked without warning or provocation. The Ilsid have earned a reputation as fierce and unstoppable warriors. Oh, and now I've the Ilsid. The speed is unbelievable. I remember from that armor. In a flash, they disabled and dragged off three of my men. You must have seen what they did to Karnak. I don't know why they did that. But I do know it would be long before they return. Find someone else to help. I have my own problems to deal with. You are my only hope. I cannot trust the rabble at the tavern. I'd sooner trust a total stranger. I just told you that. You have to go to the castle and tell the king what has happened here. This is of vital importance. Since the last earthquake, the path to the castle has been blocked by a cave-in, and we have been unable to get through. You must tell him that the Ilsids have declared war on us. This is ridiculous. You have just told me that the path leading to the castle is blocked. You should be able to go through the goblin's cave two levels down, and find a way back up to this level. It's dangerous and roundabout, but we have no choice. If you find a way back up there, you should be back in the human kingdom once again. Impossible. I've only just escaped from a goblin prison. Here, this will help. It's a gemstone dealer's license. As long as they think you're a salesman and you don't attack them, they'll probably leave you alone. I have to stay here. You are our only hope, brave mercenary. Hmm. So the gem dealer badge was the thing that we needed to get past the 
goblin lords. Um, so we're definitely going to have to have that. We have that note that needs to be signed. That is Pultius. Pul Pulsius. Pulsius is how he, his name is. We have another water basin here. And um, I don't think this is what's used to make the poisons. Or not the poisons, but the, uh, the different things. Our inventory is completely full at the moment. So we're going to have to break down this the stuff here into pies we have no apples though so we're gonna have to deal with that as well let me go ahead and just move these over we got a lot of them we're gonna go ahead oh we can't stack those but we can go ahead and use this last water bottle on this one that didn't work on this one there we go we'll move that over there <laughs> so this is the unsigned goblin authorization this is the gem dealer badge oh we now have two stacks of bottles <laughs> all right and then we have more ingredients here actually let's just go ahead and move this over here move that over there oh my goodness inventory management it's crazy right now um got some arrows over here i guess i mean we'll carry it for the moment and uh let's go ahead and check this so we get wine we're gonna drink it just because of the fact we don't want another thing stacking up in our inventory. I don't mind putting water in these. Um, just so that we can um, make the dough. But even if we turn this to dough, it's going to be another stack. And if we turn them into pies, it's going to be another stack. So <laughs> no matter what, we're going to have two stacks in our inventory for the moment though we already have this pie here that we didn't cook all right let's read this uh year 266 white season week of the rat third day today a little band of goblins tried to attack our outpost they were drunk and easy to defeat we have therefore concluded that this was not a planned attack but that it was due to the huge amounts of alcohol they had consumed. We fought off this attack without much difficulty, but nevertheless lost one of our men. Hmm, that's not very low difficulty or easy <laughs> compared to the five losses on the goblin side. Year 266, white season, week of the mole, second day. A earthquake shook our outpost to the foundation for at least 10 minutes. No damage was done, but I spotted a number of cracks on the passage that leads to our city. Year 266, green season, week of the cow, fourth day. A strange assailant attacked us this morning. He was wearing heavy armor crafted as no other we have ever seen and he seemed to be invincible every movement he made was incredibly precise and his speed was unrivaled he did not know the meaning of mercy for he killed one of my men and seriously injured two more before simply turning and leaving as quick as he appeared. His behavior made me suspect that he was sent to establish how strong we were. I think this whale is merely the first visible sign of a force which is currently growing in the safety of shadows and which will one day be powerful enough to annihilate every last one of us year 266 green season week of the eagle first day 
The strange warrior returned. He killed three of my men before I finally managed to kill him. And then, as he lay in the throes of death, he burst into powerful and demonic laughter. I suspected something immediately and ordered my men to retreat as fast as they could. There was a massive explosion that, which scattered his remains far and wide. No trace of him was left save his dagger lying on the ground. Year 266, Yellow Season, Week of the Serpent, First Day. We were woken early this morning by an earthquake. One of my men informed me that the quake that this quake caused a landslide in the passageway that leads to the castle. I am sure help will be here soon. I prefer to wait a while before sending one of my men to bring the news to our beloved king. They are probably aware that this landslide will have consequences for us. May the gods be uh, watching over us words I want to take that book just because it's a book it's a log book I'll take it for now I only have one slot left <laughs> this is a thing oh my goodness all right so I'm pretty sure these are locked 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 okay let's go ahead and head back down See if we can find a distillery. Uh, if not, then we'll go ahead and end it here. Let's see here. <laughs> Nothing on there. Am I supposed to click these pillows? Uh huh. Okay, I'm not seeing anything that would be resemblance of a distillery I think it's I think it's kind of like an alchemy table you would see in like Skyrim or something uh, let's see here I don't think we can cook on this maybe Oh, it's, you gotta get really close in there. Okay, how many bread do we have at the moment? We have two. Let's go ahead and just make sure they're really close. Come on. Oh, come on. Why is it being so difficult? I was able to get the first one. Do! Do as I say, not as I... Oh, it's, it's just turning into this is the problem. Yeah, it's... It was right there. It's right there. Wow, that is <laughs> it's rough just to get that to go. All right, we now have two spaces available. Can we make it no because of this? I'm gonna eat this. I'm gonna save the stuff. I don't see a distillery around. Uh, there's no reason to start potion making if you don't have a distillery. There's no reason to do certain potions if you don't have the items for it. How do I get up there? Can I? I 
Try and jump on this. Okay, I'm here. I'm up here. Do I have to wait for something, or is this just not a platform I can jump on? Okay. What about here? What what about this? Ah, it's not gonna let me. All right. Well, I tried. <laughs> All right, I think what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and end here. Uh, while we didn't get too much killing today, we did get through a lot of the quest slash lore portions. So hopefully tomorrow or whenever I post the next video, we will get back into the game and start adventuring even deeper. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you have any questions, saw that I missed anything, please let me know. And I will talk to you next time. This is Cypher Deck. Peace out.